Swordfish is a predictive tool that is accessible via a REST-based web API uh, that our customers can use to correctly classify or predict if a URL is likely to be malicious or not. The problem we're trying to solve with Swordfish is what we call filling the detection gap. Uh, as everyone knows, blacklists are used by nearly every corner of the InfoSec or anti-fraud industry to identify if a device is bad or a user is bad or an IP address is bad. However, there's a gap between the first detection and when that detection is actually made it into a blacklist. So with Swordfish, we're trying to fill that gap with a tool which is predictive and doesn't rely on blacklists. So Swordfish provides very simple output via the API. Um, a user will submit a URL and the API will determine if that URL is likely to be a phishing URL, likely to be a traditional malware URL, or a domain generating algorithm URL associated with ransomware or other types of malware. Again, the system does not reference blacklists, so it's designed to be 100% predictive. Again, designed to fill that workflow between the first detection and when URLs will eventually end up on a blacklist. Swordfish is quite useful for any organization trying to add a predictive layer to their security or anti-fraud data. And what I mean by that is a lot of organizations have huge volumes of, of event flows. Uh, ISPs are managing huge volumes of abuse complaints for takedown notices for phishing or malware hosting on their servers. Oftentimes it's very difficult for those organizations to quickly quantify or measure the relative risk from one, one URL or one domain to the other. So we've identified several use cases around simply plugging Swordfish into existing orchestration, existing workflows to provide that missing predictive capability that blacklists just don't offer. 